my gosh! Welcome back, everybody. And what's up, everybody? Yes, and uh, if you don't know, we are, yeah, building a tiny house right out in here. Right and, there. But first, this old, this is a fence, believe it or not. It okay? is, baby. Yeah, believe it or not, right? Yes. And uh, it's surrounded with trees and all that great stuff that we got to get cut out and move out and of the way. this fence is in the ground. It is in there. And uh, let's just show them how much. Okay, see? It's in there, but this is going to either be an epic win or an epic failure, and you're going to get to see either one, so whatever. <laughs> he has cut the fence and got the fence somewhat loose. He's already done this path right here, but now let's do this, guys. Y'all cross your fingers. Pull it, baby. Okay, there. You got it tight. Okay, you ready? Okay, baby. If something don't work, always know, never give up, keep trying, keep trying, and keep Yeah, we ain't trying. never gonna give up. What, baby? I said, we ain't never giving up. That's right. Thank you. Yeah. Baby, I'm so happy. Yeah, this is good. It worked. I, I didn't know if it was going to work or not. Okay. Well, now let's do something else. Right? That's a locust. That's a good size post, so I'm going to cut this thing off about 10 foot or something. He's got that one hung, y'all. Got it hung in there a little bit. Can do it. that yurt forecast okay cloudy currently with a little bit of wind blowing out of the northwest and but we still was able to knock three locust trees down on the ground and it's supposed to be a little more rain a little more cloud and that's all right but that's the yurt forecast 
for the Yurt Nation, y'all. All right, she's sitting here trying to do a balance act uh, for you guys. I got free balance. Yeah, please. don't don't get hurt. We're not going to the hospital, right? <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, this, this is, my... is this is hey, this is good gym stuff. No, this is good. It'll be this good post. Good gym stuff. I'm trying to step over that string so I won't fall. But look at this. I don't know if the camera. You don't show it. Don't show it, does it? No, but the camera look. does not show. But guys, we have opened up a lot more room. Look right here, this. where the chairs are at, where we've been sitting. All that'll be gone, and uh, we're going to have enough room to put it, ain't we? We're going to have enough room to put it. Yeah, yeah. Guess what, you guys? Yeah. My man, 7-1. I ain't 7-1. I Anyways, mean. Anyways, I cut these off. These locusts are really good. A lot of people's used them for fence posts for years. We're going to use them for something. All righty. There we go. I'll tell you what. There's no sense of showing y'all what we're going to be doing. We're going to be cleaning up, getting these posts and stuff and limbs that I cut up out of here. Yeah. And some more of this fence. But uh, we opened up that fence. I think we told them. Maybe we did. So we could move the footage, you know, the footprint of this house down that way some more. The fence was in the way. Yeah. These trees were in the way. But we knew this was the spot because it's pretty pretty relatively flat right here and um you know when you see stuff like excited. the fence coming up you know a piece of the fence the main part uh I you see know. trees yeah falling right and then you're like yeah wow this is really happening there's daddy pulling up over here ain't he <laughs> let's see what he's saying hey daddy hey there girly you like what we started You like openings. Hey, will you give the people a little yurt? A yurt! <laughs> so there you go. A yurt from daddy, okay? Yurt from and, daddy. Uh, so yeah, we've got this a lot more what we needed opened up. Nothing in our way to start really mapping out the footprint here. We've kind of been kicking around and talking pretty seriously about uh, different sizes already. You know, we haven't broke ground yet, put a post in the ground or nothing. I've just don't draw things up. And, uh, but yeah, we're looking at possibly going 20 wide and, um, maybe 30 long or 20 by 20. We're looking at 20 by 20, 20 wide and whatever right now. But anyways, we're, you know how you There's are. There's so many options whenever you see, oh my gosh, we got room. Yeah. And we're going, we're going to be able to fit it right in here too, because this is a pretty good spot. Once everything, like I said, behind us gets gone, a lot more room, you know, for the front porch, back porch, but uh, to get the footprint for the home started, yes, for sure. And we've got, we've pretty much got that spot right now. I mean, yeah. I'm, I'm loving this. I'm loving it, okay? I'm loving it. It so, just feels like a whole different world right here. It, well, it is, really. When and just think, open. when I was a young boy growing up, my dad had a garden right here. He uh, he had a garden here for several seasons and uh, did good. A lot of rock up here, of course, on the mountain. Uh, dealt with that, and then he, you know, and then we had chickens, and then we had a pig, and this was Hanks. <laughs> this was Hanks. He's a uh, pot-bellied pig. Poor little thing. And uh, this is where he lived his days, and then we sold him. But I gotta tell you a quick thing. Yeah, or I think we may have just gave him away. Yeah. But anyway, I don't he, know. He escaped one time and went in he somebody sure. he somebody went in their garage and he was there. Opened up the garage more, you know, to so they could go in it. Pig is in it. <laughs> <laughs> and I knew the guy, I went to school with him and you know, just but pretty good little piece from here and closer to the highway, and that pig made it, but he, he strapped that thing up with stra ratchet straps <laughs> had a closed in trailer and brought it over here you know and uh boy that was a deal and you talk about if you've ever grabbed a pig a squealing pig son it, it sounds like bloody murder Poor you know it did but we got him back oh in he his... wasn't little he got big. no he, yeah we got him back in here but yeah oh hank rest in peace hank but anyway i'm sure he's not alive yeah 
Do you think somebody ate him? I don't know, but I'm saying he's he was old. Oh, dear Jesus. He was old, kind of. And he's, that's already been several years. But yeah, yeah, had a garden here, had chickens here, had a pig here, had a dog that come up out of the woods that stayed with mom and daddy for five years. Five years. And would not even get close to them, but it was friendly and would like come up kind of close, but they never was able to touch it or anything. And they just fed it, took care of it. And it lived over here in this thicket stuff behind me and Cynthia where the coyotes or nothing could get it. I mean, it's wild. Which so a lot this of, has got, we got to do all this. All this is memories up here for me and yeah. you. And, uh, and so, and we've got some really good trees in here in this spot that we got some cedar trees that's in some spots that we ain't going to keep. So we're going to tra re-transplant those. Not this year because we're heading into winter. But uh, they're not in the way right now. No. Put it that way. But yeah. I'm excited. I don't know. I'm excited. I'm excited. I, I told Cynthia, I said, the wind's kind of blowing. And that bigger one was, you know, quite taller than them first two. And I told her at first, I'm not going to cut that big one. But after I got cut and see, I thought, nah, I'm going to cut it. I was like, are you sure? And I'll be daggum low and behold, that son of a gun didn't land right over there in that hackberry. But it didn't. Uh, it, but it worked. It I ain't think like it, it went sideways. And I was able to get it all that out, way. right? Yeah, and not I wedged. I thought I was going to have to hook the truck to it, which that would have worked too. But, you yeah. know, it. Whatever. It wasn't no bigger. If it was bigger tree than that, no, I wouldn't have cut it. But, uh, yeah, we're excited. Look at it on our faces. We've been sick for a week. Yeah. Or you have. More than a week, pretty much. And you hadn't felt good, though. At times, exactly. But I feel pretty good. And I'm still drinking after them, and I'm yeah, still kissing them. That's right. See, I did, too. But guess one who got sick? Oh, puny over here. You probably brought a bad germ, too. She got... Yeah, I probably did. Yeah. But anyways, enough about me. <laughs> Right? Appreciate it. Yeah. Uh, we're going to get out of here, and we will see y'all Saturday Night Live, okay? it's This is Thursday, and uh, we're back, and we have got some stuff on the ground to clean up and more fence to cut out. But most of all, I believe we're getting closer to where we can put this, start digging some holes. You know what I mean? I think so. So, heck, yeah. Thanks for watching, everybody. Leave us a comment. Hit the thumbs up for anything. Hit the thumbs up, okay? Okay. And uh, subscribe if you want to. But we appreciate you watching. And please hit the like button. I done told because them. Because I want y'all to love us and like <laughs> us, okay? Yeah, well, <laughs> some people love us. Some people don't like us. So you know, that's just the way the world goes. But more good than bad. There's so many people that do love us. And we love yeah. them. And we love. All right. Too. Out of here. Peace out. Love you guys, okay? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Interrupting my ending. Do you want Go a podium ahead. so we can put you? I might a need podium? to get one. Y'all write in the get comments. Up on the soapbox. If Corey <laughs> needs to have a podium. Okay, you guys. Just in and say goodbyes. Say you goodbyes. Okay, say you goodbyes. Don't boss me. I'm the boss though. Um, Alrighty. I just want to say to everybody to please never give up. Always remember just how you're special. You're worth. You guys, you have a beautiful purpose. That's right, you do. And that was a perfect heart. Wow, so, I didn't even look. <laughs> squeeze yourself so, so tight and always know that. We'll That's see right. you on the beautiful next one. Okay. Love you guys. I mean, see y'all, okay? Cuddle Bye. time.